India's road to sustainable development is earning accolades across the world. So what's really happening? Recently, the World Bank published a report in which it said that with a sweeping commitment to solar power, innovative solutions and energy efficiency initiatives to supply its people with round-the-clock electricity by 2030, India is emerging as a front-runner in the global fight against climate change. The report said that India has been giving up coal and instead focusing on renewable solutions. The most recent and most persuasive evidence is the collapsing cost of solar electricity. In the latest solar auction in the desert state of Rajasthan, the country achieved a record low tariff of Rs 2.44 per unit. The bid was won by a company which was a joint venture between SoftBank of Japan, Foxconn of Taiwan and Bharti Enterprises of India. These companies are among the largest, most serious and most successful companies in Asia. So the questions of unsustainability and the uncommercial nature of this growth takes the back seat. India also made the decision to scrap plans for 14 gigawatt of additional coal-fired power plants chiefly because solar power in the country is now viable, in-demand and low-cost alternative. Such robust growth of renewable energy is powered by Modi's major emphasis on sustainability. He launched the International Solar Alliance at the India-Africa Summit while its 121 members met for the first time at the United Nations Climate Change Summit in Paris in 2015. This collaboration has targeted to increase the solar energy use around the world. Today, India is one of the largest consumers of electricity. With nearly 300 days of sunshine every year, India has amongst the best conditions in the world to capture and use solar. Moreover, the Modi government has set the target to produce 160 gigawatts of wind and solar energy by 2022. For now, India is on the right track, especially after it pipped the United States to become the second best nation for renewable energy investment. Ernst & Young congratulated Indian government for strong support and that it helped add 10 gigawatts of solar capacity in the last three years, which was only 2.6 gigawatts in 2014. As United States President Donald Trump recently announced that the United States will withdraw from the Paris Climate Accord. Well, I'm not a big believer in man-made climate change. There could be some impact, but I don't believe it's... Uh... It did not deter Modi, even though he has good relations with Trump. At the G20 summit recently, Modi said that G20 nations need to be forthcoming on climate change action. His statement coming as a criticism directed to non-cooperating governments put explicitly the significance of the environment for India.